So you've been on campus, you've gotten kind of acclimated to the program. What's it been like so far? It's been great. Uh, it was kind of, it's been a smooth transition. I get into the apartments, getting into the lifts. Uh, it, it was a little rough the first week, uh, lifting and being away from family, but um, it's getting better over time and I'm excited to see where it goes. Uh, how would you describe the offseason program? It's legit. Uh, Coach T.O. Tyler Owens, uh, he, he's coming from Alabama. He's been at some top programs. He knows how to win. He knows what it takes to win. So, uh, I mean, at the end of the day, everybody's just trusting him. Uh, it's hurting right now, but I know it's all going to be worthwhile. So it's exciting, um, and, and I'm excited to get back to work after this week. You've been a part of the program for a while now as a, as a recruit, as a commit, but to be in it on campus, anything surprising you? And what's the overall vibe in a sense? It's, I mean, it's been the same. The family atmosphere, uh, everything that Coach Fish, everything that Coach Doherty, and the coaches has been preaching since uh, since I committed, it, it's, it stayed true, it stayed the same. So that's, that's huge. They're, they're great people. They're not liars. Um, and everything that they said, they've, they've kept their word. So um, it's been great We're trying to learn the offense, trying to get acclimated, like I said, into the apartments, into the college life. And uh, we're trying to turn this program around. It's it's uh, a great recruiting class, a lot of buzz for Arizona football. What gives you confidence that it can be a quick turnaround, Coach Fish? Uh, I mean, I think if you really watch the film from last week, or from last year, and I got the iPad, I'm watching film, trying to learn the offense, but if you really watch it, there's people open. And uh, like little little mistakes, one mistake each play, a couple mis a couple play mistakes each game, uh, change the outcome of the game. So we're close. Uh, I don't think people realize how close we are. Obviously, you said we have a great recruiting class, we have a great coaching staff, and now it's just time to put in work, uh, time to get better. What's, what stood out to you about the playbook and, and learning the offense? I mean, the terminology, first and foremost, is a lot. Trying to learn it uh, little by little. But if you watch it on film, every, there, there's somebody open on every play. And it's just it's just the job of the quarterback to find that guy. Um, it's an NFL offense, and that's one of the reasons um, I was intrigued with Coach Fish in Arizona in the first place. So like I said, everything that I was excited about as a recruit, um, it, it's held true to this day. Uh, are you rooming with T-Mac or Keon? Uh, I'm rooming with Keon. Uh, Jacob Manu, when he comes up, I'll room with him. A.J. Jones, uh, Big, <laughs> Big Jonah. So um, I'm not with T-Mac, but I'm with some other boys. What was it like having such a SoCal presence on that roster? But... It's great. I mean, we, we bonded with the guys that are from, that are from Arizona. Um, Jermaine Wiggins from Boston, we've already we've already clicked with him. DJ uh, Warnell from UCLA. So um, obviously it's great being, everybody being from, a lot of people being from SoCal, uh, still waiting on Speedy and Jacob to come. Yeah. But I mean, um, all the recruits, there's a lot of mutual respect with, with each other and we're already clicking on a, on a good basis. Certainly the big news recently was the addition of Jaden Delora. Everyone wants to know your reaction as another quarterback in that room. What, what was your reaction to him coming aboard? I mean, they told me beforehand, uh, I knew Jaden was on campus. And I mean, Jaden, he's a great player. Uh, uh, Coach Darnell Arsenal, he was my offensive coordinator at Survey my freshman and sophomore year. And obviously he comes from St. Louis, he comes from the run and shoot. So we watched a lot of film on Jaden. Uh, he's a special player. so. And also, he's on the shorter side, so I'm excited to learn from him. Um, I'm excited to compete against him, but obviously he has that experience at Washington State that I don't have yet. So um, I'm excited to learn from him. I'm excited to play with him. And at the end of the day, it's in God's hands, so we'll see what happens. Were you always expecting another quarterback to kind of come in? Yeah, I knew. I mean, obviously, Coach Fish was saying that he doesn't want what happened last year. I mean, they had one quarterback on the roster, not counting Jamari Joyner. So uh, he told me that they're going to try to get a guy, um, a walk-on or a transfer. So at the end of the day, I mean, I just, I'm just going to control what I can control. I'm going to continue to work as hard as I can. and. Uh, God will take care of the rest. Have you two talked yet? Who's that? You and Jaden? Yeah, yeah. We, we went to dinner once. We had a quarterback dinner. But like I said, he's he a Polynesian. He's from over here. He's from the island. So we so we relate in a lot of ways. Family, uh, faith. So, I mean, at the end of the day, we're, we're competing. But, I mean, I'm going to learn from him. I'm going to try to help him with what he needs him help with. And we're going to be boys. I mean, I'm, I'm close with Jordan and McLeod already. Uh, I'm close with Plummer. So, I mean, it's not going to be anything different. What What is your personal outlook for this year? What are you hoping to do individually? I mean, obviously, I'm trying to start. So, uh, that hasn't changed. Uh, whoever comes, uh, that's still the goal. That's still the end goal. Um, and that's going to be the goal until until um, until the, the depth chart comes out. So, that's what, I, that's what I'm aiming for. But at the end of the day, I'm just trying to do what I can do. I'm trying to learn the offense. Um, try, obviously, obviously, I got a head start because I came in the came in the winter, came in the spring. So, uh, I'm trying to get ready for spring ball. I'm trying to get bigger, trying to get to my weight goal. And uh, we'll see what happens. Just lastly, looking back on the recruiting process, take us through your efforts to get T Mac on board and how that unfolded from your vantage point. I mean, everybody was everybody was trying. Coach Fish, Coach Doherty, they were trying. Uh, obviously, me and Jacob were trying, and then even my mom. My mom was trying on Twitter. Uh, but at the end of the day, it was T Mac's decision. We tried to respect it, and it all worked out. I mean. Family over everything. That's what we say. We say that all the time on social media. Foe and uh, that range true. Do you recall the moment he told you, "Hey, I'm I'm doing this"? Yeah, we were we were playing basketball in the Servite gym. Uh, we were playing basketball a lot, so we were we were playing basketball in the Servite gym, and, and uh, he told me and Jacob. He showed he showed us an email, and I mean right away we we, we got up and started running around. Awesome. Thanks, Noah. I appreciate it.